Hi, it's Bruce Keith from BruceKeithResults.com. As a broker, one of the things we all know is you're not just a broker, you're a coach. And one of my favorite expressions is this, a coach or a great coach, let's start there, a great coach is someone who will not let you settle for what you think is your best. In other words, are you raising the bar on the people in your sales force so that they do even more than they thought they could? Well, how do you do that? I've got a plan for you. Of course, that's what I'm here for. Four steps. Ready? P-A-T-A. -A. That's the acronym. Step number one. Make sure that the person you're coaching has a plan. In other words, there's a specific plan that said, here's what I want to accomplish on an ongoing basis from now until X. So let's say it was now until the end of the year. So the plan would be, I want to get X number of listings taken. I want to have X number of listings sold. And I want to have X number of buyer sales. That would be a simple plan. You might break it down by month, but that would be the plan. The second A, the second part, the first A is activity. So what you really got to help them understand is, is that their activities have to equal the plan, have to equal the goals. And of course, that's where you come in. You can start saying, okay, a little bit more lead generation, better lead follow-up. Are you going after your past clients and centers of influence frequently enough? That's the activities, but just make sure they understand this has to add up to that. Okay, step number three in helping them be more than they ever thought they could be is to track their results. So this is where they should be bringing in their numbers, letting you know how they're making out and they've got to track them. Maybe they have it on the wall in their office and they know exactly, like a little thermometer, how many more deals to go, how many more listings to take. Track their results on an ongoing basis. You wouldn't play golf <laughs> without keeping score, at least <laughs> if you're any good, you wouldn't. So make sure that they're tracking their results. And then the last part, this is the key. This is where you really add value to them over and above everything else. As a broker, what you're going to do is hold them accountable. And the accountability is making sure you help them understand that you're looking over their shoulder, you're holding them accountable to what they need to do to make sure that they get their results. So how does a great broker become a great coach? Taking that approach, the plan, the activities, tracking, and then the all important accountability. Don't let them off the hook. No excuses. Okay, I'm Bruce Keith. Hope this helps you become even more effective in your job as a manager and a broker. And if you're watching this video on any place else other than the blog on my website, brucekeithresults.com, go on over there, have a look. If you could just scroll down, leave a comment. I'd love to see what you have to say. Always ready to help you. Take care and let's go get them this week.